All right, coming up next, it is a welterweight showdown between the Nigerian nightmare Kamaru Usman and Colby Covington. Our tale of the tape for this highly anticipated welterweight fight. Both fighters 29 years of age. With similar height. You ready to fight? Ready. Well, it's always great to be back in this MMA hotbed as we get underway here at the Juness Arena in Rio de Janeiro. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. These guys are exchanging huge shots. Covington gets tagged by that kick. That can't feel real good, Joe. Oh, how about the multiple strikes landing here? That is a serious offensive barrage. Flipped him with the jab. Nice outside leg kick there. by Kamaru Luz. Oh, man, defensively leaving a lot to be desired there. He moved right into that hook. His head was wide open and there for the taking. Let's see if he can make some adjustments here moving forward. Look at this. Effective strike there by Usman. It's in. He's deep. He's going to clasp the hands together. Nice kick landed there by Covington. Usman gets his so oh. bad. This could be it right here. There as he decides to stand up and relinquish oh, the dominant that's position. Some wrestling right there. Big Huge elbow, there, elbow right. to the head. Six to guillotine. One arm guillotine here. Wraps the leg around the back. He's out of the guillotine. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. Oh, elbow to the head. 90 seconds to go. Oh, nice job to get back up again. You don't want to hang out on the ground with this guy. Blocks the shot. Oh, oh huge right hand! hand. He's definitely rocked. So we cross the 30-second mark in our opening round. He tagged him again. He's hurt. Just missed with that huge kick. Man, what a round. What a round. Let's take a look at some of the action from that round. And here's a big slam. Nice technique. And here's another takedown. And here's a devastating punch that results in a knockdown. Amazing highlights from that. Ready to fight? Ready. Second round here. That one. Wow! Oh, he's hurt. He's in trouble with a huge kick last to the head. Big, Big body shot. shot. To the body. Bushman. Oh!
Well, he has landed some good shots tonight, Joe, but as yet, he has been unable to string together any solid combinations, and that has served to keep his opponent in this fight. So let's see if he can change up the tempo a little bit with his strikes and try to put together a combination that is more oh, damaging. Nice right hand. He, hurt him. he is clearly in big, big trouble. Hard hook. Oh! The left hook hits home. here in round two, much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. God, look at that takedown, man. Two minutes to go. He's back up again. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Usman gets in the clinch. Back up to his feet again. And from here, transitions to the Muay Thai clinch. Neither guy doing much at this point. Usman's got the Thai clinch. Let's see what he can do with it. Covington gets the over under. And separate. Eats a, ni a nice right hand. Well, some have gotten through, Joe. This shot is blocked. There's that nice leg kick. Final seconds here of round number two. Now he goes for the single leg. And the horn sounds on round two. What a round it was. Maybe a round of the year candidate. Knockdowns on both sides. You don't see that every day. And here a big shot lands and a knockdown. And here another big shot lands and another knockdown. And here another clean shot lands and another knockdown. Good to have Brazil's Jenny Andrade in the building here. Ready to fight? Ready. Yeah. Third round underway. Takedown attempt there. And busy as he looks to improve position here. Oh, nicely done there as he escapes back to his feet. Double under hooks in the clinch. that chin. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Oh, hook to the head by Covington. He's keeping his head protected here. Excellent blocking. Gates up to his feet. Very nice. That one hurt. Takedown defense holds up. Nice. Well, he gets... Oh! He's rocked! Right. Oh, the fence is shaking after that slam, Joe. Covington gets back up, back into his comfort zone. Big straight punch. Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. Switching stances here. Looping left hand misses the target. God, look at that takedown, man. He's back to full mount again. It looks like he's trying to set up an arm bar here. He's got the arm here. Now he's gonna throw his leg over. Turns the hips. 
He's gonna sit back. And he's out. Looking for a guillotine. He's in full guard here, looking for the guillotine choke. What he needs to do is, he needs to wrap his arm around the back of his opponent's head, slide his forearm underneath the chin, then he needs to clasp his hands together, and then, oh, and this then fight's over, this fight's it. over. He got in the choke, refused to tap, and went night-night. Yeah, and that's about as good as it gets with that choke. And if you're not willing to tap out as he was not, then you're going to go to sleep. And that's exactly what happened. A beautiful setup and even better technique to get the finish to put him out cold. And so let's look at it again from another angle. He doesn't even get a chance to tap. And one last time, excellent technique on that choke for the submission victory. So there he is, your winner by submission, and that's exactly how you put the rest of this division on notice. Looks like this guy could be a factor moving forward in this division. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop for this contest at three minutes, 53 seconds of round number three. For the winner by submission, Kamaru! So there he is, your winner by way of submission. And candidly, Joe, I'm not sure this night could have gone any better. He did have some doubters coming in. He said, I got to mute those naysayers. And they're not going to keep quiet unless I can actually get this guy out of there. So mission accomplished. No judges necessary tonight. He gets the submission. And now all that's left is to celebrate with his coaches and training partners. What a moment for this oncoming fighter here tonight.